Hello everyone, this is Kaushik from Cool School. As you can see, this is my fantasy Premier League team going into game week 1 of the new Premier League season starting this weekend. In goal, I have Liverpool's Alison Becker, who is probably the best goalkeeper in the world. I prefer to have one specialist top class goalkeeper like Alison, who keeps lot of clean sheets and another goalkeeper with least most price tag. This is because when my main goalkeeper is injured before a particular game week, I replace him by another top class goalkeeper before that particular game week starts. This way, my second choice goalkeeper need not have to be uh, a regular starter for his team. So if you see Alison starts, in the previous season he has kept 13 clean sheets and he has even provided one assist which was actually against Manchester United uh, for Mohamed Salah. The numbers are less actually. This is, be this is because uh, he was injured and has played around 900 to 1000 minutes less than uh, what he has played in the previous season. In, uh, in his full season, he has actually kept, the 21, kept, kept 21 clean sheets and one golden glove. So he is my uh, first choice goalkeeper. And my defenders are all uh, regular starters in uh, their teams. Firstly with uh, Conor Cody, who is the captain of Wolves. He is simply reliable, uh, ever present in uh, Wolves backline. He is the reason why, he is one of the main reasons why Wolves uh, finished 7th in the previous season. And if you see his stats, he has actually uh, played all the matches uh, in, the, in the previous two seasons. So 3420 minutes, that is all the matches he has played. So such a reliable, de reliable defender, um, that's why I have picked him ahead of any other uh, Wolves defenders. And uh, the Wolves backline is very good and their goalkeeper uh, Rui Patricio is also very good. So all of them have kept 13 clean sheets last season which is great and uh, I, we can expect you know um, the same kind of uh, number this season as well. So Conor Cody for sure in my back line and next is uh, Stevens, Stevens of uh, Sheffield United. He uh, actually was the was Sheffield United's best uh, defender in terms of uh, fantasy Premier League points. In fact, he was uh, on level with uh, his fellow fullback, uh, Baldock's uh, fantasy Premier League points. So he uh, is actually good going forward, a left back. He has scored uh, two goals and provided four assists in the previous season and has kept 13 clean sheets. So Sheffield United has uh, you know, a very good defense, the defenders are very good. Sheffield United are going to miss uh, Dean Anderson for sure this season as he has been uh, moved to Manchester United. But still their back line looks solid and I would like to have uh, Stevens as one of my uh, uh, defenders. And along with him is uh, Seamus Coleman. Seamus Coleman is the captain of uh, Everton, another regular starter whom I can rely on and in the previous season uh, he has actually no, no, not played uh, all the matches due to injury but uh, you know he is a very reliable uh, defender and he is also good going forward so we can expect uh, some assists also from him and my other two defenders are also regular starters in their teams one is Van Besaka in fact he would have been in the starting uh, team if uh, Manchester United were playing in this uh, game week. Since they are not playing, I have kept him in the bench and uh, yeah, he is a, a very reliable defender and uh, he will uh, keep a lot of clean sheets this season and also could provide a few assists for Manchester United. And uh, my last defender is uh, Stuart Dallas of Leeds. He is a key uh, defender for uh, uh, Leeds, a key, very uh, key player, versatile player. He can play as a defender and he, also, he can also play as a midfielder. He is an extractor for Leeds United uh, going into this Premier League. So definitely looking forward to you know see him play. So these are my five defenders. Connor Cody, Stevens, Coleman, Van Bissaka and Dallas. And all my midfielders are actually wingers. And they are regular starters and are extremely vital players for their teams. I prefer to go with two top class midfielders who are regular starters in top class teams. For this, I went with uh, Salah 
of Liverpool and Pulisic of Chelsea. For the price tag of Salah, you can either go for Mane or Kevin De Bruyne or Sterling or even Aubameyang. But I went with Salah because if you see his stats in the previous three seasons, he has gone on an average of uh, 10 assists per season and uh, on an average of uh, 20 goals per season. That is simply huge. So I simply had to go with uh, Salah and he is my captain in this game week as we are playing against uh, Leeds United at home. And uh, my other uh, star midfielder is uh, Pulisic as I said because Pulisic has uh, simply been uh, deadly last season as you can see his stats um, he has provided 8 assists and uh, scored 9 goals you know with just 1700 minutes imagine if he plays you know uh, all the matches like 3000 to 3500 minutes the numbers will be definitely huge right so i went with uh, pulisic and his price tag is just 8.5 since i went with uh, pulisic for just 8.5 i could reinforce other three midfielders i went with uh, philippe anderson of west ham his pace and trickery can be deadly for the opposition and also the pace of uh, triore uh, can create havoc in the opposition defense and uh, saint maximin of newcastle he had a great uh, uh, first season for newcastle he is a very good winger and he is always a key in all their attack and he is uh, you know he is he was just involved in all almost all their goals and if you see his stats uh, he has just played 1800 minutes and scored three goals and five assists He was actually looking really good as I was uh, seeing uh, Newcastle matches. Mm, he was, you know, uh, a key in all their attack. So I went with these five uh, attacking uh, midfielders uh, or wingers. And my forwards are Timo Werner, Jamie Vardy, and Michi Batshuayi. So I prefer to go with uh, two top class forwards and one decent forward. My top class forwards are Werner and Vardy. because Vardy was the golden boot winner the previous season and his stats in the previous seasons are simply phenomenal uh, in the previous season he has scored 23 goals and he has scored 18 and 20 goals in the seasons before so that's simply huge so i went with Vardy and my other forward is Werner Werner because uh, he uh, will definitely score a lot of goals this season and uh, he has a reputation of uh, scoring goal even when he is not playing well and yeah i went with these two instead of uh, kane or ings or aguero i didn't go with kane because he takes several matches to score his uh, first goal and i didn't go with ings because uh, ings is not a better forward than uh, these two werner and vardy because werner and vardy play in uh, better teams with, and they will have good supply and i didn't go with aguero because aguero is uh, injury prone we can't rely on we can't rely on him in terms of uh, fitness and we never know whether pep will go with uh, aguero or uh, jesus so that risk factor is always there that confusion will always be there so i went with uh, werner and vardy and my other forward is michi batshuayi who is on loan from chelsea he actually had a, a loan spell uh, before a uh, couple of seasons back uh, in the in crystal palace itself and he was very vital uh, for them so we can expect uh, you know uh, many goals from him this season and i have a lot of flexibility in this team actually so whenever crystal palace play against top 6 teams i can drop batshuayi to the bench and i can go with 3 5 formation with the, all my five attacking midfielders and my two star forwards and i can also choose my defenders according to the opposition since all five of my defenders are regular starters so i have this flexibility in choosing uh, players according to the opposition So I think uh, this is a balanced team with lot of uh, rotations possible. Please comment down below your uh, thoughts on my team. We will have discussion in the comment section. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video.